I'm with Jessica, who is NTC Manitoba, and she's running this CNC competition here. It's pretty... I'm stressed. How are you feeling? I'm a little stressed. I have a competitor as well competing, and I'm nervous for all the other competitors, too. Yeah. It's a lot of... It's a lot of pressure. It's, it is. It's pretty stressful. Under the umbrella of skilled trades, it's way more than I would have even thought possible. Yeah. Like CNC, so I didn't. It wouldn't have been something that I would have thought of. I didn't even know about CNC machining until my dad told me about it. Yeah. I had no idea. That's literally same thing. My dad told me what this is what we do in construction. I was like, okay, construction. That's yeah. it. My dad was like, I'm tired of you being a server. Come for a tour around my shop and see what you can do. And, like, and you okay. loved it. I fell in love with it. Okay. And I've been machining now for over ten years. So. Okay. Really wow. CNC machining. So. Mills are right behind us. Okay. Lathes are on the back side. So mill takes square pieces, makes it square, round, whatever shape you want. Um, the competitors, they are given a solid model this year, and then they have to make the tool pass. So they have to use the tooling that we give them in our tooling documents. Okay. And then they have to remove the metal. So just taking away what's not necessary. Yeah, so that's what you're just telling me even letters. for this. You're removing yes. where the letters are, correct? Yes. Okay. Yeah. And then the lathe, they take round parts and make them more round. So start with a round sock and then you put threads on it so like nuts and bolts okay you all start with a round sock material and you remove what you don't want to oh. and then you have a physical part after that's so interesting yeah. so do each competitor has to do both or just yes. cnc or just lathe so for this year um in this skills canada level they compete on both machines okay day one they're on one day two they're on the other okay so they compete two, like twice in over two days never in the same day that's way too much to do yeah but they get um, an hour of programming, two and a half hours of machining and programming. So they get a total of three and a half hours. Wow. There's a drawing. Give me the part back. It, that's it right there? Yeah. So on the computer there, you can see that's his programming. So he's using Maxicam. Oh, and he's measuring he's right now. So, wow. Yeah. So we actually do have a GoPro set up to kind of see Oh, how cool. It it. But the mills have nice big windows. So you can actually see what they're yeah. doing. Yeah. But the lathe has a little bit more of a reduced area, but if you walk down the other side, take a look at them. Also. Okay, the I will. The pretty cool. Um, yeah, but this year's a world qualifying year. Yes, So yes. the difference now is we have one winner, gold, silver, bronze, as a total. Mm -hmm. But then we also have to look at who got the top scoring mill, who got the top scoring lathe. Oh, okay. And who's age eligible. So it could be third or fourth place down if the older ones are not over, over age. Except they could be not... Age. Yeah. They could be knocked up and going to world skills. Absolutely. Wow. So it's a lot more process in the judging yeah. department. Yeah, so every two years, it's a little bit more work, but it's a little yeah. worth it. Yeah, I'm really excited to see who makes it and what happens. Me too. Because they're amazing. That's wonderful. Grants, scholarships, everything. This is such an important, an important yeah. event. Uh, this is such an important event. And how is the day going so far? How long have you been in this? Um, I've been involved with machining since 2011. I've wow. been involved with skills as a competitor and an NTC member since 2018. So been a few years but we've been about an hour and 45 minutes into our competition right now with our first set of competitors and every three and a half hours we usually have a new set coming in so it's a jam-packed day wow from eight till five o'clock okay yeah that sounds pretty busy and thank you for yeah. <laughs> thank you for giving us your time and walking us through this process yeah. it's really wonderful that you can go from competing and now you're here and you're training and you're are you are you part of the judging process um not us uh, necessarily we do some group judging for like the, the little things but yeah most of our measurements everything happens with miss toyo okay they bring all the equipment you can see all the fancy little wow, stuff yeah. over there and they have big cmms that do all the measurement for us so it makes our job a little bit easier which is very great we yeah appreciate it because running these competitions and keeping an eye on the competitors is a lot of work all absolutely <laughs> absolutely but you're you're killing it you're doing a great job awesome. thank you so much the best I can. <laughs> you, you're doing wonderful it was awesome to meet you That's so cool.